Hey everybody, John Linetti here, speaking in Bakersfield, California. Offer up a prayer for us if you would. So without a doubt, one of the biggest complaints I hear against the Catholic Church today is that it has too many rules. I hear it constantly. John, I'm spiritual but not religious. I don't want to be bound by all those constricting and confining rules that the Catholic Church has. Maybe you've said the same thing. But my response, friends, is always the same every time. All right, hear me out. I have a five-year-old son and a three-year-old daughter. In my house, my wife and I, we have a lot of rules, a lot of rules. For instance, I remember a while back, I was trying to teach my daughter that she needed to look both ways before she crossed the street. We were walking out of Target and right before we ventured into the parking lot, I looked down at my sweet little Gianna and I said, honey, we need to look both ways before we cross the street. And she looked at me with those beautiful brown eyes and that smile and she said, no. And I said, well, this isn't up for negotiation. We're either gonna look both ways or we're not crossing. And she looked at me and she said, why? And I said, because I'm smarter than you. Anyway, finally, finally, she looked both ways. And after doing so, we walked to our car. But I remember her face the whole time, right? She was so angry. She wasn't mad. She was mad. I was the meanest dad on the block. And I put her in her car seat. You know, she kind of like turned away from me. She didn't want anything to do with me. After all, friends, after all, all she wanted to do was just run free. But see, I knew as her father... I knew that if she was just to run free into that parking lot, she would have never been in any more danger. Friends, I'd do anything to keep my daughter safe. And this is what's behind the church's rules or the disciplines. The church is our mother. And like any good mother, she only wants what's best for us. She wants us to be free. That's, that's why we have these disciplines and these teachings, not to constrict us or to compete with us, but to free us. I'll leave you with this, friends, and I'll paraphrase it from St. John Paul II, whose feast we just celebrated. He said, freedom, true freedom, is not doing whatever we want. True freedom, friends, is having the right to do what we ought. True freedom can only be found in the good. So take a step back, look deeply into these long-held teachings of the Catholic Church, and walk free. Pray for me, friends, and I'll be praying for you.